Hello and welcome back ladies and gentlemen this is your host LL here and today I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to set up your own Terra domain and also how to sell it. Previously I did tutorials on unstoppable domains and also Ethereum name service which actually did an airdrop week ago which was worth around $10,000 or more and who knows Terra name service might be the next one to do an airdrop so keep your eyes on this one and grab yourself a domain. So how do we start up? So first things first, you will be needing the Terra Station extension. Yes, you can probably use the mobile one as well and perhaps the desktop one, but uh, the Terra Station on uh, as an extension is the way to go. Make sure you have some Luna and also USD available for the transaction fees. You are uh, the lowest amount of the domain cost is going to be $16 in USD. So you'll need at least that much to basically get your own domain on this service. On the FAQ page, you basically see the pricing on all of these uh, domains. And plus five characters are going to be 24 USD per year. Four character ones are going to be 160 USD per year. And three characters are going to be 640 USD per year as the domains go. A lot of the popular ones obviously have already been purchased, but there's a lot of games still, um, uh, hidden gems, they're still available on the market. So um, let's get started. So the first thing we're going to be searching obviously is what type of a domain we want to buy. And the domains are using .ust as of right now. And as you can see, I tried Subway, which is a big company, and it's already been taken. And here you can see also the price for that specific domain. A lot more of the expensive domains are still available, but people have basically snatched out all of the major companies. I think there is some, you know, still left in the top 100, which you could possibly uh, snatch yourself and maybe flip on later or maybe you want to use it yourself because these are addresses which can be also receiving payments for but uh, I'm gonna be reserving my own name here just in case nobody will be impersonating me in the future I previously already bought piratebay.usd which I thought was a, a bit of a steal and I was pretty so shocked that nobody had gotten it so now that we see that the actual domain is available here um, we are going to be uh, going into the registration period. There's going to be a fee for the actual gas for the transaction. There's going to be a small tax being paid and there's going to be the registration price. Now, if I'm going to be choosing to uh, take it for 21 years, that's going to be how much it is. Two years, three years, the price will change determining on how many um, actual years you're going to be purchasing the tax will change but the gas price gas price will be the same for all of the years you're not able to take 1.5 for example or apparently you are so um, I'm gonna be just making 1.2 here just a uh, maybe 1.25 okay that's that's fine for me so that is gonna be the time that we're gonna be registering this domain for and here is a bit of a screenshot of everything that you can see on the side Next up, we're going to be clicking register, request to register. And what you didn't see, there should be a connect button here on the top when you first enter to the website to basically log into the site. Now request to register and now a pop up will come out with um, actually first making you log in. And obviously there's going to be if you have already logged in, it will have the pop out like how much is everything basically taking on. And this will be taking roughly around 20 seconds to basically um, get this domain and then it will be basically yours. That's how easy and simple it is basically to register your domain with the Terra name services. And now we are seeing the registration price, gas price and the tax. And now we are basically signing the transaction itself with the costs. Here we can see all about the contract and the numbers and I will be clicking post and now the actual transaction gone is going through. So I'm not paying this twice. The first time was basically a login system. And now I have acquired the domain and I see when it's going to be expiring. That is going to be on February 17th, 2023. 
And that's how easy it is basically to uh, register the domain. And now when somebody wants to send me money or tips, they can use lightliger.ust. And this is the point when you're going to be opening up your wallets and sending me all of your money. Well, I'm just kidding. Now, the big question obviously is, okay, I'm not going to be using this domain for myself. I'm here in the interest of flipping this domain. Now, this is not financial advice, obviously, and there's a lot of speculation on domains, on other crypto domains, for example, but there are a lot of risks involved. It doesn't mean that the USD is going to be the next um, domain to be in the market, so we don't have any guarantees that these will be selling, but there has been volume. Some have been bought already. And we can go into two different marketplaces. One is Random Earth. And here I have already my PirateBay.ust, which I've set at 10 Luna. That's where I'm selling it at. So you can basically log in, go to your um, My Items list. And here I can go to my items. I can uh, filter things out as, as well. And here I'm probably going to be scrolling here. And here I have the Light Liger UST that I just bought. Clicking sell. Then I'm going to be setting out the price, which is going to be sold at. And then how long this sale is going to be uh, going on. You can also allow counter offers, uh, basically bids on your uh, sale. And then you're going to be clicking next and it's going to be selling it. But since I'm not going to be selling this domain, I'm not going to be doing that. And the other marketplace where you can go to is nowhere.art. And here you can go to basically my profile, my NFTs. And here you should be able to um, see the T. Uh, here is also claim TNS button. I'm not sure 100% what this is for because um, I maybe, we maybe you cl basically click that after you have bought it. And here you can have manage NFT and then there is sell this NFT and set price and sell now or you can put up a normal auction basically uh, for the actual domain auctions can be pretty good sometimes for these types of domain stuff. So I kind of like that. But that's basically uh, everything in a nutshell. It's extremely easy to get one and uh, buy one. And um, then if you want to keep it, you can keep it to receive transactions, or you can also use it as, you know, um, gathering, uh, you know, flipping it later on. And you can also get some um, USD really fast on TerraSwap. So you basically choose Luna and then you just choose USD and you make a swap and you get some easy dollars here. This is probably the fastest way. If you have the Terra Station on desktop, it also has a swapping feature and burning feature for Luna. But I like to use TerraSwap, you know, personally, even though it has a, a bit of a TX fee there attached to it. But thanks for watching. As always, stay tuned for other videos on the channel. Check out also the video about unstable domains, which by the way, haven't done an airdrop yet. They might do one. And um, obviously, if you want to set up one on Ethereum, you can also do that. And if I'm going to be finding more of these domain websites, I'm surely going to be uh, dropping out videos how to do them in the channel. See you later on the next video.